Alright guys, it's Vuitton here. I'm coming at you today with a solar fishing controller guide. Um, on the screen is the requirements for this. It's 12 billion bucks. It's a lot of swamp tar. Just buy at the shop. It's not that bad. Um, and then, not swamp tar, swamp paste. And at least 12 to 13 ropes. And I have runes on there as well because of the fact that this shop is so bad for restocking. Um, you can get all of your stuff here, but it could be annoying to wait the time on the ropes. Um, but yeah, you can get everything here, bailing buckets, rope, and etc. But there's a stack of 10 here, and 10 is not necessarily enough for a solo. You need 12 to 13. At most, you will need 13 rope. There is no way more. Um, but you can start fishing car over here to just get it started. It'll be a one minute wait. I'm not going to make you guys wait that one minute. But also, I'm going to go over a recommend bladed dive and, um, mobile. You don't necessarily need it, as I just did the last fishing trawler, only using Surge, which mobile does help, but it's not necessary. And you also need the keybind, the full bailing bucket, and the non-full bailing bucket, because the keybinds are going to make stuff a lot better. Um, but outside that, I'll be right back when the trawler starts. Alright, we're starting the trawler now. Um, the, goal, the thing about the trawler that you have to be wary of is your meter up here. You don't want to worry about the activity meter in a solo at all, but you need to worry about right up here if the net is okay, if it's damaged, etc. If the net is damaged, we have to go upstairs and click interact with the net and spacebar through it. Um, and that uses up a rope per time. Outside of that, really, it's nothing more than management here. You need to be filling these leaks as much as possible. And it becomes nothing more than a balancing act. Um, let's just continue with this. Because eventually this is going to fill up with water, regardless if you actually get to the leaks fast enough or not. It really doesn't matter. And this is going to be me doing a full treasure crawler solo on video and just making comments as well. So I might ramble a few here and there. Alright, so it says up here the net has been ripped. Also, Mur Murphy will say the net is ripped. Let's go up there, use the net, boom, done. At most, it could rip is 1 per minute, hence the 13. I put in the um, recommended. Can I actually bail? You can't bail into the water. Alright, net ripped. Yeah, it's been ripping every minute for when I did this a couple weeks ago, it never really ever ripped. So it's a little bit of RNG on the ripping, but that's the reason I tell you guys to bring 13 rope. And also the these on the screen are for teleporting here. Um the runes so that you can just go to max skill, get more rope out of the bank, or just stockpile on rope. I'm probably going to buy 1k of this for whenever I go for the uh, shark tooth necklace. And then play to dive over here. Because this, 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 you can't catch any fish while this net is ripped. This net is your number one priority. Alright, so now we've entered bailing mode. Alright, I've keybound both these to the um, action bar. Now, as a note, you can um, empty bailing buckets while moving around. But you cannot bet, you can't fill them while moving. So like here where I'm going to a leak, you want to kind of start holding down the the button to um, empty it while you're going through and um, moving around to each spot. I'll create the net ripped. All right. Keep this under control, keep it under control. And by the way, do not panic with this at all. 
and do not look at the bar. Uh, other than the, the net ripping, do not look at the bar because of it's just a panic factor. We're not in actually any danger here with the water being this high. Okay, we got that. All right, thank you. And just a reminder, just keep removing. Hold down the empty bailing bucket while moving around to these leaks. Okay. Start bailing. Oh my lord, bad RNG. Uh, I am going to get an Eritoria bail. So that when I go up here and inspect this net, we can actually just empty out a bale. That's a good strategy for that as well. Though you do potentially lose some fish, but I mean, just think about that for a sec. Is it a really big deal to lose a fish or is it a big deal to lose a crawler? We're getting really lucky with fish too. Let's just empty this out. But like I said, the goal is to keep it to try to fill everything up and then empty it all with um yeah, I'm gonna do this quick. Alright. Right. Fish nets okay, we got five more minutes. We're on we're holding good, we're holding good. I'm going to bail buckets here. Alright, and then we're going to fill these two. Then we're going to go get this fish taken care of. Like I said, it's just a balancing act. You will get used to this as you do more. If you're even going to do more. Because there's a very rare item that um, you can get from here. That I think is pretty cool, but I don't know if it's worth grinding this. I didn't have it, which is called the shark tooth necklace. Uh, you can get shark teeth from this place, and whenever you get five of them, you could stitch them together for a shark tooth necklace. Necklace, and it actually is a five percent bonus experience at Ark for um, fishing wobble gongs. Is it worth it to get it for two hundred mil? Probably not, but because I don't know how long this is, this actually takes. No one has ever given me drop rates, so I can't actually calculate it. Holding strong. Oh, damn it. The net this one. Here we go. Really, net?
lives. Can we get it down to no no water? Can we do it? And their fishing trawler. It really isn't that difficult to solo it. A lot of people think that it's like impossible or whatever, but here we go. Spec trawler net. We got silver ore, 15 mana rays, and sea turtles. Alright. And then you can just click them and then they sent straight to your bank. But yep, that's just a fishing trawler. It's just a management game. It's kind of actually a little fun, like, just seeing how you can just, how well you can do. But that's it for me. Um, this is a little long, but I wanted to give a full example of a fishing trawler. Um, so here we go. And have a wonderful day. And like, comment, subscribe. And note, I will be streaming more than likely getting the shark tooth necklace um, at some point. So um, stick tuned for that and have a wonderful day.